So we are finally live, uh, but it's going to be edited into a video on YouTube. It's live on Twitch. Check out my Twitch channel, Hunter Motors. You know the stuff already. But uh, once again, hello everybody, and uh, today we are actually going to be talking. <laughs> We are actually going to be talking about uh, some of the races that are going to be happening this season. Uh, nice to be here once again uh, for another video slash live stream. And uh, first of all, I'd like to start with ending the confusion that has been going on with us for a while now, which is what will be the fourth race of the season, sorry, the third race, no, sorry, the fourth race of the season, and it's, it's confirmed by NASCAR officials that it's going to be Nashville, the fourth race of the season, as Pocono has been moved back to its original place as the second last race of the season, the penultimate race. But uh, it's definitely going to be an interesting season, Alex, and uh, I can't wait to, to enjoy this one, yeah? And Phoenix has actually been moved to the sixth race of the season, though after Phoenix, we're actually going to be going to Sonoma, the Rocos, and then we're gonna go to Kota, and we're gonna go to a bunch of maybe three, is it three other road courses uh, this season? So there's going to be a total of five road courses this season. So it's going to be quite the packed season. Well, the thing is, that's not the only uh, track that had been touched and moved around by NASCAR. Actually, another. A uh, track that had been moved around was Bristol uh, which will be in fact the fifth race of the season before we go to Phoenix and then after all of those five road courses then we're gonna go to Bristol dirt but uh, NASCAR organization still struggling with the decision of Bristol Dirt, but they were definitely uh, got a firm, we've definitely gotten a firm hand on the decision of whether we're going to go to Bristol or not. And yes, it has been confirmed that we are going to be going to Bristol here in 2023 of NASCAR 21, the same. And it's definitely going to be quite interesting to uh, to see how the drivers will react to being at Bristol Dirt. Yeah, but obviously there are a lot of things that could come into contention this season, especially if one of the drivers were to get sick or were to have personal problems. There are lots of things that could go on for the drivers they could even uh they could even get fired halfway through the season due to reckless driving because we've decided that this season in the regulations that can happen to drivers now uh i just wanted to mention quickly something that uh had happened the remember uh the whole chaos about investigating Ty Dillon's car because of his suspiciously good performances. Well, the NASCAR officials have discovered 
that they were using an illegal fuel injector to the engine that allowed the engine to have way more power giving them giving him quite a bit more speed and because of that the team had been fined one million dollars uh, for breaking regulations and honestly that's quite a hefty fine I, I mean i myself was surprised about the price the sheer price of that fine but uh, to be honest if you consider it the team had it coming to them because of using that illegal fuel rig so maybe we'll see a sudden drop in performance or maybe the team will make an advantage somewhere else maybe with the chassis weight or or weight distribution in the car or aerodynamics you know anything can come into play when it comes to the how the performance of said vehicle of which we are speaking about true as we have said anything can come into play but otherwise goodbye those on youtube we will be continuing with some questions answering questions on twitch uh, live but uh, goodbye ty and that's alex hunter signing off have a good one now let's answer some questions on twitch i will inform you when the next live stream drops Ooh.